I do a beer review today. Um, the beer that I'm reviewing today is by, by brewed and bottled by Great Divide Brewing Company out of Denver, Colorado. Nice bottle, nice label. It's almost like a wine label, like recycled shit. Um, like I said, it's called Fresh Hop by Great Divide Brewing Company. It is a 6.1 alcohol by volume. And of course, it's a pale ale. Uh, food pairings, so suggested food pairing: grilled trout, grilled bratwurst, garlic, ginger, sweet potato. So pretty much, probably your whites, your white, your white meats and whatnot. Let's go ahead and knock this off. It has a foil here. This beer is definitely one of the more. Um, well packaged bears. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and no that's not the situation. A lot of a lot of steam. A lot of steam coming from that. Ooh, it's definitely hoppy. I mean it's called fresh hot for a reason. <laughs> And pretty much with this beer, it says it on the on the uh, actual label of the bottle. Pretty much lets you know exactly what to look out for. It says uh, fresh hop, grassy, citrusy, pale ale. So you already know exactly what the taste is going to be like. However, it's a good thing to just see. It's telling you what to look for or what it, what it's about. But at the same time. What combination is it? Is it a great combination of it? Is it not a great combination of the different things or whatever? I'm gonna go ahead and grab my glass. I'm gonna try this motherfucker out. You know what I'm using? A mug, chilled. I just got it back. It, uh, it didn't last in the refrigerator too long. It was, it was in there and I was just like, ah oh, man, I'm chomping at the bit to go ahead and taste this one. This is the pour. This is this is a beer looking beer if I ever seen a beer look like a beer. A bit carbonated, you can tell. It's looking good though. Hey, can you come grab this real quick? It's a little bit left. You wanna try it? Very beautiful looking beer. Let's see if I can change the camera to wear a little bit more light. It's all crooked. It's all crooked. <laughs> it's all crooked. Screw that. Go ahead and get it. Get it how you live. I'm going to go ahead and taste this motherfucker. I'm in the bottom right corner of the fucking thing. Uneven hills. <laughs> Uneven hills. <laughs> anyway. You automatically taste the uh, hops, the look at that. Produces a thick head. Mm. Wonderful beer. I'm really liking it. It is beautiful colored. Produces a head to stay in there. It's kind of thick. Let's see if we can get in there. Bope. Very good beer. It's like an amber color. Here's what it is. Hate Amber. Whoever that is. If your girlfriend's name is Amber, dump that bitch. It has hints of a. Uh, Grapefruit. I'd say grapefruit, oranges, maybe a Delilah, maybe a hit of a hint of uh, periwinkle. Has a very periwinkleish taste. Um, it's a 6.1 uh, alcohol by volume. Great beer. Truthfully, I like it a lot. Reminds me of uh, 
all the ones that are like hop executioner, you can leave that there. That's her text that's her text uh notification sound. SpongeBob. Guess we have a kid, huh? Damn. <clears throat> Commercial. Do 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 Damn. I wasn't trying to do that though. But look, as you can see, I just topped it off with the rest and it built a muffin a muffin top head. How beer supposed to be drank. But what I will say though, truthfully, like I said, I'm done with the whole whatever. But it's a good beer. It's very It's full of hops. Full of hops. Full of flavor. Like I I I say this. It's a it's a strong beer. It's a strong beer. Not thick at all, of course. It's a pale ale, but it's a strong beer. If you drink this, it's like a snack. And the flavor hints on this beer is insane. Like I said, it's a bitterness from the hops, of course. Super hot out. It's hooped. It's hooped. But it's a huge presence of flavor, which a lot of hoppy beers is just like just bitter. Like, but this beer is like packed full of flavor. It's 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 a great beer. Um, with that said, I'm gonna go ahead and drink a little more of it. We get down to the bottom, room temp. We'll see what the hell it goes down, bro. Totally. Freaking mosquitoes and shit. I hate bugs, man. I hate outside. As Why I said, I do I this hate video outside? outside. God, but definitely a good beer, man. Like, and for what it is, it gets you somewhat of a buzz pretty quickly. 6.1. Isn't that crazy, but it's good shit, man. It reminds me of like a, um, a periwinkle colored, like, gazelle running through the forest of Amsterdam. While smoking on a black and mild, not really. <laughs> it's a good beer though. Like truthfully, if you can find this, make sure you get it. Another beer that I liked. This, I think this beats it out. Now, it's a beer from here, Sweetwater Crank Tank. Really good beer. Really good beer. But after having this one, I think this right here may be my favorite beer, Pliny the Elder. I'm still looking for one. down to the last drop. <laughs> you Great Divide Brewing Company. You have a good thing going. Fresh hops. Wonderful fucking beer. I like it. That would be all. Class is over. Oh yeah, I forgot. Beer Advocate gave it a 91. Random reviews from people that had it gave it a 93. Exceptional beer.